couldn't remember the mic, the mic company. I'm gonna have to get that from you again, so we can write that the letter to them. Bach, Bach, Bach. like Bach and Beethoven. Oh, okay. They got a rough one next week, boy. Oh my God, dude! Oh. You, know, you know who you know who they got to play next week? You, you, you know you know who they got to fucking. Oh my God, dude! Yeah, I'm not I, I'm not even gonna say any fucking more, man. That, that, that's gonna be you know that's gonna be the Monday night game over here. So I'll probably have to get over here early and watch it with you. Word. Yeah. I'm gonna you're you you you're gonna you're gonna probably sit I'm gonna be the guy that's gonna sit next to the box. Yeah, Alright. He can sit right there. You want me to sit right there? Because I'm gonna be doing the video oh, on there. Yeah. yeah, yeah. So you guys are up. Uh, Hold you know, on. I'll be monitoring you from the other room, but just remember to shake that mouse so you're everything else is hooked up. Okay. Which thing do you want me to do for you? Well, look, uh, our direction is upside down. down.
listeners out there, I'm Bang and Dean. We'll be firing up the show here in a minute or two. Appreciate you tuning in. You and I are listening to C4OC in Santa Ana, Southern California. Hell yeah. Just for the Facebook audience, brother. Now you can. Yeah. I had it over here, brother. Yeah, yeah. Uh oh. You just think. Testicle difficulty here as yeah. I'm trying to find my way around this board, but um, rest assured I will. As um, a lot, lot of stuff, uh, got his eyes dependence on, on it. Um, uh, no, we're not. In fact, we're, we are keeping you updated about the game. So. Maybe that was your intro. All yeah. right. So, anyway, where are we going to start off? We can start off uh, a couple shows last night, last last uh, weekend attended. Uh, that would be the Friday night show over at the Tiki. That was another other world production broadcast um that was with jackie davis of course at the tiki bar we had 10 foot you um we had black elk unfortunately i wasn't in to see them um and we also had augmented chaos and uh masters of reality and i was able to get a video from all of those three bands that's on my site vila biet betsilla very cool so you can go ahead and uh give me a friend or uh I'm sure that's also posted on C4OC content, but uh, make sure to check those out. The great local bands. Um, again, Augmented Chaos, Masters of Reality, and 10 Foot U. Um, Augmented Chaos, of course, wonderful band. J. Patrick Makosar just tears up that guitar. He's the shredding man from hell. My hero for sure. Okay, Looking forward to seeing him soon. I, I believe they're going to be playing soon. Um, a couple Saturdays from now, I believe, over at the Doll Hut. I think they're going to have a Slaytanic type show. Um, That'll be a nice show. Gato Fedo, I think that's going to be, if I'm not for remembering correctly, uh, Wendy Camargo's 30th birthday party or that something along nice. those lines, if I remember correctly. Um, so um, so that, that, that would be the next time you're going to be able to run into those guys, certainly. Um, hey, we got Michael... House of Metal Cummings in the house. Hi, Mike. How you doing today, brother? So, uh, we we have tapes of those, and then also um, the uh, Masters of Reality uh, show. What what a great rendition of old Sabbath tunes they do. They just tear it up. Um, and I actually got to speak to the gentleman um, the next day over here at the compound. I'm just talking about his musical influences and um, sitting out there in the back. 
And uh, what a wonderful player he is. Um, he just tears up Sabbath. Um, augmented Chaos, of course, that, that, that goes without being said. Um, masters of their craft. And um, also, uh, we've been having um, some quite the substantial Sunday night barbecues over here at the compound. Now that Sunday Ooh. night football is um, in full swing, um, these barbecues and this uh, feasting and then having some drinking and then uh, it's it's turning and into be really involved. really fun fun affair now. Um, the extra ambiance of the Sunday night football games, of course, was adding to that. Um, last night that was really nice. So uh, if any of you guys have the notion, you can always come by here on Sunday nights um, when when the uh, owners uh, have have the padlocks um, <coughs> unlocked and all can come in here in the compound and enjoy a Sunday night football with us. Again, we are C4OC Radio. I'm Bangin' B, and this is the Hell Yeah Show. Hell yeah! So, <laughs> so um, let's go ahead and uh, go ahead and say a couple words about our fine sponsors. As always, they are the ones that help us bring this show to you. I'll have them up here in a minute. Of course, hell yeah! Hell yeah! Of course, our fine sponsor, Steve's Meat. As everybody loves to have his meat in his mouth, even the guy that's Steve's chattering over, over here on the next, uh, in the control button room. Um, I don't know if you can hear him off camera, but um, certainly he's there. Um, so Steve's Meat's a wonderful uh, catering and barbecue person. He also does parties. When you need the meat. Right. Call Steve. <laughs> then we, of course, have Viper Guitars, and those are guitars with venom. Absolutely. The fine folks, Jeff and Kima Heitman. Heitman. Hell yeah. Over there in Marietta. Always a big shout out to them as they provide um, a few of our guitarists, guitarists with the guitars that they play. And we're also a um, big shout out to Jim's Music. As you know, um, the station here on Sundays does their installment of sometimes they'll do a blues program over there, but usually they're going to highlight an up and coming type local band. It's always a wonderful satellite broadcast they offer on Sunday afternoons. That's over at Jim's Music over here in Tustin. And, of course, Zigzag Rolling Papers. Ooh. Enough needs to be said about that. And then, of course, our Devong Signature Lighters, courtesy of Mr. Ross Knapp, the drummer of Devong, which by uh, uh, is is the K-U-T-E house band. Always Legalized Marinette. Love, lo love to broadcast those bands and hang out with those guys as they were here at the compound yesterday. Always a joy. And um, I have a whole case of those lighters at some point I'm going to need to give out to you guys. So we're going to start thinking of some different promotions um, here when I do the live streams. And then also um, when I'm doing uh, uh, the live streams locally too um, at the events. So we're going to think of some new things. And you don't want to get stuck without a lighter. Certainly not. So... Let's go ahead and talk about some of the upcoming shows that we have in the pipe. Um, yeah, going on. Looks like Friday night. That's going to be Femme, Femme Halen. Ooh. They're going to be over at the Santa Fe Spring Swap Meet. But they're going to be doing the night show that night. So that's going to be 7 to 11 p.m. Um, I believe tickets are $2.50, but I, I don't quote me on that. Sometimes those night shows can go as high as $10. Um, I'm not sure. Um, I'm looking here at the, at the Facebook page, and I'm not seeing anything that's indicating a price so my guess would be um it says Bem Halen have you seen them no I have not mm -hmm. love to check that out it says free show with admission well how Ooh. could it be how could how could it be free if you're you're paying admission so uh, I, I I I would guess that that it would be 250 because I know I've gone on some nights it's been 250 on Friday nights but don't quote me on that so anyway I got two tickets to accept you can give away Ooh, balls well, to the wall. Why don't we go ahead and set that up for the next commercial break? I'll go ahead and announce that. And um, in the meantime, we're going to go ahead. Uh, we've got a pair of tickets wall. to the Accept show. <laughs> um, that's going to be with Betrayed by Faith. Um, that's going to be show up, I believe, up in Calabasas. Or no, Santa Clarita. Hell yeah. So make sure that if you Hell go yeah. ahead and uh, win those tickets, you, you got to make sure and make that show. So you're, you're, you're going to be down for the drive. So you're... So just keep that in mind. It's not a very local show. So there is going to be some driving involved in that one. Um, how you doing, John Miller? 
Don't make sense. Jeez. Here, let me give you a dollar. <laughs> okay. So, we're going to talk about some more events. So, that's going to be that's going to be Friday night. And let's see what else we got here. And also, Tim Saxton Band. He's going to be playing Friday night, too. He's going to be returning over there to Gallagher's Pub and Grill. So, what street is that? On? Let's see. I, I believe that's, that's in Huntington Beach. Yeah, isn't it? I believe Gallagher's that's downtown in Huntington, Huntington Beach. Beach. Yeah. My hometown. Home of the Zach's Cove and Rock and Roll Tiki Bar. So Tim's going to be having having a show over there. That's going to believe probably probably kick off around 8 p.m. Is that downtown or? Yeah, that's going to be on uh, Pacific Coast Highway. Mm -hmm. And uh, he's going to be over there. Um, do, by the way, Doc Patillo, very very famous guitar technician in this county for a couple decades. He's also in that band now. So um, uh, wonderful wonderful um, band. This is a good blues band. You enjoy blues? Yeah, check it out. Go and check that Gotta one out. See it. That, that would be definitely worth your while. And, of course, that night, which I'll be do, probably doing, that's going to be the Slaytanic Show Friday, September 21st, for Wendy's Dirtieth 30th. Um, that's going to be at the, at the Doll Hut. I guess that's going to be kicking off around the 8 p.m. Dirtieth 30th. Yeah, that's going to be with Slaytanic, you know Treasure Under, Beyond yeah. Roots, Slaytanic, and then, of course, Gato Feto, and then... Our house band Devong is going to be there for K U T E. Bah, bah. More than likely, we will we will have a live stream broadcast set up for that. But again, please go out and support the bands. Carmen Bar, Friday night as well. Anxious Carmen Annie Bar with Ooh, they're great. artist. Okay, so oh, yeah. I've, I've seen oh, yeah. them. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah. So if you, <laughs> some of you guys don't preach, don't don't mind taking the drive down to South County, um, that that's going to be and. Uh, let me uh, go ahead and get that one out for you. That's going to be at the Carmen Bar Friday night. This Friday night. Hell with yeah. E. Lou the Dust, Sovereign Artist, Anxious Annie, and Mine the Gap. Okay, that's uh, again, that's the Carmen Bar. That's out there, 5 Freeway, Crown Valley Parkway. Exit west for first right hand turn. You've never there. seen anything right like there. Anxious Annie. They're a real treat. Pipes here. And we have some more things here. Let's see. Um, we got Fire Tiger. They're going to be over at the Viper Room. Fire Tiger is a, a, a band, um, a fairly decent pop band. Um, they're going to be at the Viper Room. Uh, I just saw that because I actually have done some filming with that band over for the Ultimate Jam. I'm on Tuesday nights, as many of you know. Um, I am involved with that. Which tomorrow night is going to be symphony themed night. For the ultimate jam, that's going to be at Whiskey A Go Go. That fires off from about one, for excuse me, 9 p.m. to 1 p.m. And that, again, that's a free admission show. Um, nice. All ages except 21 and under after 10 p.m. is ten dollars. So if all you youngins are going to get there, you want to get there early. So um, we've also got. On Saturday. Metal 101 is going to return to the Slide Bar in Fullerton. That, that's going to be an afternoon show for all you headbangers. It's going to be from 2 to 4 p.m. You haven't gone and checked one out one of those Saturday afternoon broadcasts. Highly recommended. Have a fun time. A lot, lot, lot of nice place to have a beer. Good venue. Fun place to go, especially on the, in the afternoon. Great place. Metal 101. And we have Fuel and Hypnostic at the Rose. That's going to be um, up there in Pasadena. That show's going to fire off around 7 p.m. And um, we have Lance's birthday bash with the tributes to Depeche Mode and Duran Duran. It's going to be kicking off around 7 p.m. Um, that could be a top rock production with Lynn Nicholson. It appears to be. Um, don't, don't quote me. And then also... Um, at the at the Rock House, we're having Little Sammy's seventh annual birthday bash. So, I guess stay tuned. Bands to be announced. So, if you went to the one last year, you know what 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 fun those have been, and and they've had many more in the past as well. So, and then we also have the Gas Lamp Unplugged for the '90s tribute. That's going to be over at the Gas Lamp in Long Beach. That's going to be firing off at 7 p.m. Also, Carmen Bar, Saturday night. 
We're going to have Ed Force One, too hot to handle. Ladies getting after there, tearing up that UFO. Um, and, of course, our good friends, Masters of Reality and Glamour Toe. That's out at the Carmen Bar. Doors at 7 p.m. Show starts at 8. Go ahead and check that one out. A lot of stuff going on um, on Saturday night. Um, here's another one which we'll probably more than likely be involved in. That would be probably more than likely a C4OC radio broadcast. Um, I haven't confirmed with the boss and, and the management here, but I'm sure that's going to be. And that's going to be at Malone's Bar and Grill, House of Metal in full swing once again. Cool. Ravenscroft, Void nice. Vader. That's, that's a band that we're going to start keeping an eye on over here at the station. So they're definitely on our radar screen. Doctors of the Earth. MGH and some bands yet to be named. I don't have that right up. Um, it looks like 7.30 p.m. doors. And I, my guess is maybe 8 or 8.30 showtime. So go and check that out. Um, it looks like Motor Gun Hotel is now going to be on there. Ward, War Within and um, Cavoltenblanc. So there's three, there's three more three more bands for that one. Again, Friday night. Saturday night just looks like another action-packed night of just great heavy metal and hard rock local talent here that for, for all of you to enjoy. Um, this I highly Saturday? suggest yes, I highly suggest you guys get out and support the bands here. There's an SK Live private party, but in a video shoot, I'm not sure um, if that's a public thing, but that's going to be with Tim Saxton Band, the Lazy Stalker, Bear Squares. Bad Bruno and Ian Down. So maybe we might have some uh, footage for you on that. So um, that's going to head and wrap things up. It looks like over here the game is over. And I believe the last time I looked at it was 24-10. Um, it looks like that's going to be Chicago over Seattle tonight. So um, without further ado, we'll go ahead and uh, slip back into the music here. Get stuff queued up. Go ahead and, and uh, take it from there. Again, we appreciate you tuning in to tonight's broadcast. We are C4OC Radio, Santa Ana, Southern California. I'm Bangin' B, and this is the Hell Yeah Show. Hell Yeah! Again, I'd like to give give a shout out to our Facebook audience. Thanks again for tuning in to tonight's broadcast. Again, uh, we are live simulcasting as well. C4OCRadio.com. Again, that's 24-7. Your online go-to radio station can receive that anywhere in the world. And again, that's going to give you the best hard rock and heavy metal local unsigned band talent that this county has to offer. We bring you nothing but the best. As as you've heard from the promos, that is our mission and we strive to do that. Again, all we appreciate metal, you all the time. We again we appreciate you doing it. I'll I'll, I'll also um, I also do my K U T E and I am Southern California's local band live stream leader. But again, um, we we coordinate the two efforts together to make this great thing that we have, C4OC Radio. Appreciate you tuning in. Um, we're going to go out back, um, get a little, get a little uh, drink, and thanks again. I'm just on live stream. I'm just on live stream. I know, but the button's still on the down. Long the days of the wicked, the wicked, wicked, wicked. Revelations become a black hole in a universe.
Listening to C4 OC Radio, nothing but the best in local artists of all genres.
present Masters of You're listening to C4OC Radio. Nothing but the best in local artists of all genres.
wouldn't make it a habit. I wouldn't make it a I wouldn't make it I wouldn't make it I wouldn't make it a habit calling me that thing. Denster here with C4OC Radio's Denster's Meds Metal Show. We're interviewing Mike and Ed from the House of Metal. Big Mama here with C4OC Radio. Just wanted to let you know a little bit about one of our sponsors, Steve's Meat. Have you tried Steve's Meat? He is the best rock and roll barbecue catering in town. If you need an event, a family reunion, or anything else catered, give Steve's Meat a call. 562-842-5237. Don't you want Steve's Meat in your mouth? I know Big Mama loves it. Yeah. 
You and I are listening to C4OC Radio, Santa Ana, Southern California, and I'm Bangin' B, and this is the Hell Yeah Show. Hell yeah. Appreciate you tuning in to tonight's broadcast, and again, thanks to all our international viewers for tuning in. I know um, I'm looking at my screen over there on the other side of the room, and it looks like the Philippines is here, and also Thailand. Thank you for taking your time out this evening. Go ahead and... Uh, Share that broadcast with your family and friends if you get enough time to do that one as well. Thank you very kindly. Um, in wrapping up, as you can see right here, our banner. Um, we are football season right now. So, again, uh, wrapping up two nights, Monday night football game. That's 24-17. The Bears over the, over the Seahawks. Seattle starting oh, off 0-2. Russell Wilson sacks another game six times again. Looks like we, the Broncos, sacked him six times last time, which was last week's game, and that's 12 times he's been on his ass in two weeks. Wow, rough start for them. The Bears. And so without further ado, uh, as we kind of going to incorporate a little bit of football involved in the show since my show kind of overlaps with the with the ending of the Monday night football game and of course that's going to be the case for the next six months so um, we're incorporating that little piece as far as um, the broadcasting schedule here also um, we want to make the, the listeners aware too um, we also have uh, barbecues um, over here um, on Sunday evenings for Sunday night football too, and we will probably be running some tape in the background here. Um, I, w I would anticipate next week, and I'm gonna have a little bit oh, in the back. Fun. I'm gonna share that with you. Um, so once we got this monitor pretty dialed in right now, we'll go ahead and uh, get that a little bit more incorporated in the broadcast oh, that's um, for you guys. Yeah. I like that. Okay, so um, I guess we'll, we'll go ahead and we'll play some more music. Again, um, we're going we're going to be giving away this pair of accept tickets, so uh, stay tuned for that, and we'll have those up um, probably a little in, in the first part of next hour. Again, we are C4OC Radio .com. I'm Bang and B, and you and I are listening to the Hell Yeah Show. Hell yeah! And as always, appreciate you tuning in because without you, we just absolutely cannot. Be effective in what we're doing. Again, we are C4OC Radio, Santa Ana, Southern California.
go to our Facebook audience out there on Bang and Beat, and this is the Hell Yeah Show. You and I are with the Radio. Listening to C4OC Radio, Santa Ana, Southern California. I'm Bangin' B, and this is the Hell Yeah Show. Hell yeah! Thanks again for tuning in to tonight's broadcast, and please, as always, share it with your family and friends. So, um, I wanted to uh, h- highlight another series of things that I, I neglected to not mention in the past, but I'm going to now. Um, Slide Bar, which all of you know is a great venue um, for many bands. Um, it, it has a few stages um, there. Um, the location is just very nice. I um, always like to go back to my alma mater and go see bands over next to the train it's station, cool. and which the train I always used to go home to New Mexico on. Um, nice. So nice stop, and they've just got a whole nice uh, area down there with the bars and the, um, the breweries and great place. Um, so Slide Bar has been doing this um, for a little over two months now, maybe. Um, They have Metal Mondays, um, Mm -hmm. and what that is, and that's a free show, and they're going to be having metal uh, bands that are going to be there every Monday night. It's a way to bring in the week, metal. Right. My guess is, too, if they actually have that in the main hall, you know how they have all those monitors Mm -hmm. on the wall? More than likely, you can you can probably watch the game and watch the band. Ooh. So, <laughs> if you're a diehard football fan, kind of like myself, it's that would be something football. that would be kind of interesting, you know, it uh, added attraction to just go ahead and try and see how that is. Because I know I've watched bands before um, at the uh, um, the slide bar and some rather substantial ones and have been able to watch the band and keep track of what's going on over here. And it's just, it's, it's very easy to do there. It's just kind of fun place for that. But anyway, that's great. Um, so they're going to, so they've been doing this and I, I don't, I don't know how long they'll keep it up, but my guess is they want to make this um, somewhat yeah. that's consistent type thing. And, uh, Hell yeah. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. Cool. Metal and football. They go yeah. together. So, so that's going to be kicking off. That kicked off actually, but little, little over an hour ago, um, and it looks like that's going to be Black Sabbath set by the band The Rare Breed. So Rare they're going to be firing that up. Rare. Like our pal is back here. And let's see. Volume four of Metal Assaults Metal Monday at the Slide Bar Rock and Roll Kitchen will live up to its name with a very special Black Sabbath set. By fast, excuse me, fast rising LA stoner rock band. Stoner Trier. rock band, yeah, stoner, the rare breed. That's what band. I said. I'm read. I read right off the prompter here, guys. They will be performing several tunes from vol- the Volume Four album, plus other Sabbath tunes and originals. That sounds good. I I like that. So that again, folks, that's a that's a 8 p.m. free show. So go ahead and check that out. Um, as always, you know, uh, 
also do the ultimate jam on Tuesday nights. But again, I um, want to just get a, give a shout out to our local venues. Um, they are the ones here um, in Orange County that are accessible to most of us. And um, they got something going on on Monday nights. Yeah, if football is not your thing or if football is your thing, you can enjoy both. How about that? little added extra special bonus. 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 What you do is you go out to the show and then you have your headphones in and your phone on the game. And you're like, yeah. Hell yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Hell yeah. So we're coming up right, right up just a little past the top of the hour. Reaching hour of 9 p.m. We are K. Excuse oh, me, yes. C4OC Radio, Santa Ana, Southern California. We get right back here into the music again. <coughs> and as always, appreciate you tuning in to tonight's broadcast. Hello? Hello, love. Can you hear all right? Say again. I said, can you hear me all right? Yes. Yes, I can. But what's that sound I hear in the background? Remember what I was telling you about? What are you talking about? You mean last night? I'm afraid I can't remember. Here, love. Have a listen. Very cool. Metal meds. You and I are listening to C4OC Radio and American Animal on Bangin' Bees Hell Yeah Show. Hell yeah! Hell yeah. 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 Oh! 
such a long time you became hypnotized by the undertow. Radio, Santa Ana, Southern California. Hell yeah. Appreciate you tuning in to tonight's broadcast. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. So, <laughs> go ahead and talk about a, 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 some more beat. shows co coming up in a couple weeks, Ooh. which Saturday day, September 29th, is going to be a hell of a, hell of a night for shows hell in yeah. these parts. Yeah. So, one that's going to be here is going to be the Monsters of Metal Fest. That's a 20... Whoa. Um, <coughs> gosh, it's, it's, it's going to be almost a 20-band lineup. And that's going to be over in Garden Grove, over at the Garden Amp. Nice. And let, me, let me throw out some names over here. We've got, we're going to have Made in USA, Moto Breath, Perfect Strangers, Project UFO, Disaster Train, Ghost will be over there. Um, eight bands, two stages. I think it should be Diamonds and Rust will be there. So... Go and check that out. That's actually going to start um, at 5 p.m. I have a thing I got to go shoot over there for Perfect Strangers. So you'll see a little bit of my live stream over there for that. Um, go ahead nice. and check that check out. out. And then um, Fallen Union at the Grove that same night. They're going to be opening up for Angra. So you can go ahead and check that out. Um, I may have a pair. Excuse me. I may have one ticket for that. Um, that I'll give away on the show here. And um, we'll go ahead and probably try to give that away next week. And we also have Surface Tension and Devong. And we're all going to be opening up for Graham Bonnet. That's also going to be the same night. Whoa. It's 29th yeah. over at Malone's. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. That should be a great, great hey, show. Hells Except yeah. balls to the wall. Come on. That's some acceptance roulette. right here. On the table. May I see Boom. You? Somebody's going. Somebody. Somebody's getting laid that night. Go on. Michael Cano, the same night, over at Fitzgerald's. He's going to be having <laughs> Dazzling <laughs> Urbanites, Migs Whiskey, Sabins. Jimmy Craig's going to be going out there for that one, probably with the solo band. So, and we're also going to be having Miss El Kasajian's band, Parker Street Gypsies. So that's going to fire up around 8 p.m. So you can go check that out. Next one, Otherworld Productions with Jackie Davis. Looks like we're going to be having the band, bands for that night is going to be Shield of Faith, Misery Business, <laughs> The Bastard Monarchs, and Sons and Hares. And then, of course, also Sunday, which the tickets we're going to be giving away for these. September 30th, the Canyon at Santa Clarita. Touch up balls through the wall. So th those tickets can be either mailed to you or you can go ahead and pick them up here at the station. So th the question is tonight for these two tickets right here. What brand of guitar does Glenn Allen Paul play? What brand? What brand? Mm. So, we're going to give we're, we're going to give you 2 minutes to answer that. If not, we're going to go on to the next question. So the clock is ticking. Again, we are C4OC Radio, Santa Ana, Southern California, live from the in-studio compound. And as we go forward uh, yeah. with the broadcast here, we will be introducing Hell musical yeah. audiences yeah. to come in here, sit on the couch, do an interview, and then, of course, do a couple songs over here, back in here, kind of like a Johnny Carson type thing. Very cool. So, anyway. Bang and B. He's a Johnny Carson of our time, Bang and B. So we're not going to get too far really ahead other than the, the two-week time frame that we just, you know, uh, shouted out to you again. Um, the reason, part of the reason I'm doing that is there is so much stuff. That's next guess. And it looks like we have about a one more minute for that one, and then we'll go on to the next question. Nobody's got it? Nobody knows that? No, it's... it's, ah. it's 
It's just I, I always liked his guitars because the shape was always the one I played. I think this might be a good question. So if anybody's is gonna um, try and do it, I think we may just keep this one up. Again, we're, we're a variety show, so we we kind of can do what we what we want. So not really bound by any rules here. Let's see here. Oh, apparently I'm having some problems with the streaming. Okay, here we go. So again, the, the, the question is, what brand of guitar does Glenn from Betrayed by Faith play? Glenn Allen Paul's brand of guitar no, is what? This isn't going to give it away, but what color is the guitar he plays? You know? He has a white one and he has a black one. Mm. So there's a hint for you. Maybe he can help you visualize it. Well, you, 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 all I can say is you all have seen many videos that I have live streamed of Betrayed by Faith sets with, with that guitar in his hand. So you tell me what brand of these these two tickets can be yours if the question is right or excuse me the answer is right <laughs> got that backwards apologize for that well you know with that in mind maybe we probably should get up roll up roll Ew. up some more music get that queued up so again you and i are listening to c4oc radio santa Ana, southern california i'm banging b and this is the hell yeah show hell yeah Blocks, big blocks. You hear me? Big blocks, big blocks.
big blocks. Big blocks. You hear me? Big blocks. Big blocks.
Listening to C4OC Radio, Santa Ana, Southern California. I'm Bangin' B, and you and I are listening to the Hell Yeah Show. Hell yeah! And um, I don't know if uh, any of you got the uh, little post that we had today on Facebook, and uh, that was talking about the new blues festival that we went and did over Labor Day weekend. Well, I was just over in the control room a little while ago, Zach, and the video is coming along very nicely. It looks like they have most of the first day done and starting to work on the second well, that's day. That's exciting. So um, I know their post was, cool. had all kinds of pictures on it. I'm looking at it right now, and it was 37 pictures deep of all the food trucks and mm, other nice. other things that they had going on over there. So, um, again, the Blues people asked us to do the video here. And um, so we got in the cutting room over here in the control booth. A lot of great music. Yeah. I I should have gone both days, I guess, but, you know, the Saturday was a very busy day for me. I exactly couldn't do that, but uh, Sunday was a real treat to be able to do that. But, again, those people took really good care of us. They fed us. They gave us water and soda and chips and cookies and hamburgers and hot dogs. Hell, yeah. Yeah, it was very nice of them. I can't can't say how, how well they, they treated us, and they gave us a, a nice... Uh, place over in the back we had our generator going on and you know next year I, instead of one easy up we'll definitely bring two 
yeah. yeah we had everybody that oh, right. came over there oh, and um, interviewed with us and so we're going to be able to make a tape out there for you guys. So just reiterating Looking that post. That, yeah, that's, that's cool. That was out a little bit earlier today. I the thought news. I'd mention it. Yeah, you guys check that out. So there, there's some good stuff in there. Um, one of my favorite bands is a band called Red House, and they had um, uh, Ham and Organ that was hooked up to one of those Leslie, those ones, the whirl around ca stereo cabinets. So the sound was really, really super deep. I love nice. that Hammond or organ sound. It's just addicting. So um, anyway, we'll check in with you in a few minutes. So we're going to go ahead and roll some more music. Again, we are C4. And some weed. Hell yeah. <laughs> we are C4OC Radio, and I'm Bangin' B on Southern California's hard rock and heavy metal leader. Hell yeah.
Dempster here with C4OC Radio's Dempster's Meds Metal Show. We're interviewing Mike and Ed from the House of Metal. Check it out. So the Roxy, House of Blues, what when it was still up there? Well, let's take it from the beginning. Let's take it from when it started. What was the very first steps that took you guys to want to to make a forum like this, to make a scene, if you will, the House of Metal? We threw around a bunch of ideas. We had like a well, whole but laundry list. Before that, we <clears throat> didn't realize each other had moved to mm-hmm. California. Yeah. You guys knew each other before. Because we had lost touch before because we grew up in Jersey. You guys went to high school, right? Yeah. 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 Okay. In Jersey. Yeah. We've known each other for 30 years. Yeah, what high school years. did you guys go to? Richfield Park High School. Say hi. Okay. Park Richfield Park. Park. Well, welcome to the village. Welcome to the <laughs> village. Right. Sorry, right. you coming in? There you welcome go. Welcome to the village. <laughs> but yeah, when we came out here and we, you know, started going to shows and it was his idea to, he just show up with his camera, you know. Yeah, it's in vans. Okay. They must have thought he was like, who the fuck is this guy? Before we get going too far. Like, when you guys were hanging out in school, what was it like? You guys are metalheads, obviously, if you're like me back in the day, which you probably are. Just give us, like, one day in the life of, of Mike and Ed back in high school. Fuck you, douchebag. <laughs> <laughs> high school days, was uh, there was a mall that we'd go to you know, on Sundays. Because the county that we lived in... The, they had some like the Bergen County Blue Law. Yeah, you couldn't sell clothing in our county. So the malls were closed. Retail was yeah. closed. Oh, really? All so retail. So we'd go clothing? to like a couple counties over where it was open, and we'd get you know, fucking baked out of our minds. 
I don't know why we picked Sunday to go to that mall. I mean, it's because it's just friggin' huge. Yeah, it's true. Good mall. Whatever else you're gonna do. Yeah, yeah, pretty much. It's <laughs> a typical day. If you're like me, we I grew up in Utah. And so, like, that was it. Yeah, that's what I was going to say. It was we, the mall. We, we've heard of dry counties where you can't have alcohol, but I've never heard of dry county where you couldn't buy clothing. Yeah. There you go, yeah. That, that's different. That's Seventh different. day, you got to rest. Easterners. <laughs> so, you guys, so back on it. So, you guys, so you guys grew up, had families, grew, you know, did your life, whatnot, and then you guys got back together. You guys found out. How'd you run guys, into each other out here? Yeah. My, my best man told me that he was here. And when he told me, like, the town he was in, I was like, oh, it's got to be, like, hours away. Yeah. I didn't realize it was, you know, right next door. Right next door. Yeah, right <clears throat> down Orange County, like, you know, 40 minutes or so away and shit. Yeah. It was all good. Yeah. yeah.